Good morning, and thanks for having me. I'm here to talk to you this morning about using technology to improve floor cleaning in your restaurants. We'll explore how technology can help reduce costs, increase safety, and improve overall image. Let's face it, throwing labor at problems just isn't easy as it used to be. Labor rates and benefit costs continue to skyrocket, and we need to ensure our team members are focused on selling, taking care of our customers, and protecting the brand. Focusing one of your top expenses on these tasks is the goal of most operators. Plus, now that we have those great employees, we want to make sure that we keep them. So keeping them engaged and doing tasks that they enjoy will keep them working for us. Let's start with something that many of us have been a part of. Maybe we've done it or we've watched somebody do it, and that's painting a room in your house. As you can see here in this picture, there's a lot of different things that we need to be painted. We have big open areas. We've got corners. And then we've got tight spots around windows and trim. Very challenging. But, you know, we've got a couple tools that you can use here. So let me ask you, would you rather have a paintbrush or a paint roller? Anybody? Brushes? Got a few brushes? Some people over here that, that want the roller? Does anyone want both? I see a lot of heads nodding. Absolutely. My wife, who does a lot of the painting in our house, she says, yes, we, we need both. You need that big roller to get into the large areas which will clean, uh, paint those areas quickly and evenly and reduce the amount of time to clean the job. It's a high productivity tool. Even at a high level of productivity, though, the roller is limited. It doesn't get into corners. It doesn't do edging or even tight spots. This is why we also need a paintbrush. Now you can get into the tight spots, do edges, and complete the job correctly and get the best results. The idea here is to utilize the correct tool set to complete the job as quickly as possible while achieving fantastic results. In the end, you want your newly painted wall to look great. The same can be said for cleaning floors of a restaurant. There's large open areas, and there are also more challenging areas with many fixtures, some movable, some not. So how do you clean quickly and efficiently using an optimized labor model to create a clean, safe atmosphere for your guests? How do you do this while optimizing labor and maintaining or reducing costs? This is where technology can help you. Utilizing mechanized cleaning tools like floor scrubbers, vacuums, carpet and upholstery cleaners help achieve the goal of a cleaner, safer restaurant. They also allow you to optimize your labor demands by increasing efficiencies, saving time, and even reducing soap usage. Today, there's a variety of options available in a variety of sizes and power sources to help a restaurant operator clean more efficiently. These tools are the paint roller from our previous example and are widely used in both front and back of house. But you're also going to need some of those paint brushes. Those are brooms, mops, deck brushes, and other like tools. Those do the detail work and clean in hard to reach places. Both sets of tools help achieve the desired goal of cleaner, safer restaurants using the optimal amount of labor. The key is to identify and understand your desired cleaning state. Do you want to focus on front of house, back of house, bathrooms? Do you want to use existing labor, add hours, or even reduce hours? Will you hire, replace, or supplement with an outside cleaning partner? What other savings can be measured? Can you use less soap? Can you avoid slip-fall instances? Are customer service scores higher? Let me give you a few examples where these strategies have been successful. The first, I'm going to call the Eliminator. This is a franchise that has 10 locations and was using an outside cleaning service daily. They just weren't satisfied with the quality of the work, so they decided to try using their own team members. They bought a mini floor scrubber, added some labor hours for their people to do the job of cleaning. The productivity of the floor scrubber allowed them to do the job in less time than just mopping and deck brushing. It also achieved superior cleaning results. The floor scrubber was the very efficient front of house and bathroom cleaning tool that helped them eliminate the cleaning service, do it themselves, and save money. After adding the floor scrubber and the additional labor hours, they were still able to save $18,000 per year per location. What kind of results would this help you guys achieve if you were able to make similar type savings? Now let me tell you about the reducer. As I said earlier, labor is becoming more and more expensive, and most organizations are really trying to reduce their labor hours to save money. This is a 350 location chain, replaced their mops, and added a small floor scrubber to clean the front of house areas and bathrooms. These tasks had previously been done by their own staff with just mops and buckets. When they added the floor scrubber, they also reduced their janitorial hours by 1.2 hours per day. They found floors were cleaner than ever, the staff cleaned multiple times daily with a floor scrubber, and the reduced hours had no impact on their daily janitorial needs. 
On top of that, they reduce their usage of floor cleaning soap. So let me ask you, what would a reduction of 1.2 hours per day mean to your bottom line? Lastly, let me tell you about the improver. This is a 500 location chain that needed to add a small floor scrubber to improve their image. They just weren't getting them clean enough to meet their needs. Well, they added the new asset. They also changed their process and documented it in their standard operating procedures. They also were looking for more data and are adding a telemetry solution to allow them to report on daily usage and get alerts for lack of use. This ensures the new process is being adhered to and the cleaner floors are attained. To be successful, they also needed a partner with a national footprint to support their local managers and provide service when needed. Today, floors are cleaner because the team members are bought in on the new process. In summary, let's face it, labor is expensive and it's getting more expensive. Optimizing the time your team members are in the restaurant and ensuring floors are clean, dry, and safe is imperative. We suggest utilizing the paint rollers of today's mechanized floor cleaning solutions to help reduce and optimize labor for large portions of your floors. These solutions can help increase safety and improve image while saving you money. You'll still need the paintbrush, mops, brooms, deck brushes. Those will be used in the toughest to reach areas. The combination of the two will achieve best results. Drier floors or safer floors. Choose your partners wisely and ensure they can help support your footprint and ensure your solutions are operational when needed. Be sure to add the right tools and ensure optimal uptime to achieve maximum results. I thank you very much for your time and your attention this morning.